Ongele kona aga pumi. Ay. We should do this in the future. We should do this in the future. We should do that. When he was inside, he's like, eh. Hey. What's up, guys? Hope you guys are having a wonderful day. And uh, we have a small little update on uh, Bushiri's extradition. Today was the ruling that was supposed to decide whether the witnesses will have to go to Malawi in order to uh, to go and explain why Bushiri should be extradited back into South Africa. And uh, the judge actually did make a ruling today and uh, we surely lost. <laughs> we can all go home. <laughs> but we're going to talk about that and also some of the things that they were saying. And uh, one of the articles that I actually saw on Malawi 24 and a certain quotation over there that I'm going to actually quote from. And uh, let's, let's talk about it down in the comment section because this is actually a very interesting turn. Particularly to what they said. It's the reality show today, the Christian commentary videos. If you haven't seen that particular story, mm -hmm. then the judge said, No, chief, uh, you are actually in the wrong. As a matter of fact, the, the testimonies of the witnesses can be done and recorded in South Africa and be sent over. Simple. Now, this particular thing that the judge said here is contrary to everything Bashir said. He and his people. It's contrary to everything. Bear in mind, his first reason for running away was that South Africa is not capable, doesn't have the right justice system in order for it to have him have a fair trial. The judge is saying, no, they do have it. <laughs> Number one. Number two. Uh, Bushiri and his people, they, they are now saying, I think it's his lawyers or whatnot. In the article, as you go down, there's a part where they're saying mm, they're very happy with the judgment. <laughs> you know, being a child, being a child is difficult. Being a child, because mm, you have to keep flip flopping. And the followers are dumb enough not to notice. Now, let me highlight how the followers are, are really just blind people. And it looks like their blindness is going to be permanent. <laughs> it, it shall be permanent. <laughs> hey, what the Lord has done for you. No, no. Uh, okay. For those that are saying, Hariki, are you saying God has made them blind? The Bible says God shall send them a strong delusion that they should believe a lie. They believe Bishiri because they have not loved, they do not have the love of the truth according to Thessalonians. So a false prophet has been sent to them uh, they go astray and go to wherever they want to go to. Yeah, you don't have the love of truth. It's better we tell you. You know, us, we are very, we are very peaceful people. We are nice people. <laughs> Number one, when we share and thing, and these people, they've been fighting this thing for two years. They've been fighting. They've been putting rules. No, the Malawi thingy does not actually have the part where they, uh, they, 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 they need to be there. But then all of a sudden, no, we haven't gotten any letters to, of uh, requiring him to be extradited back. Then they shifted from that to the South African government is not capable of, uh, of handling Bushiri's case with justice. Then they used Zenofo. You understand? They used Mzenovo. They, they used Mzenono over there. When they used Mzenono, uh, all of a sudden now, they're saying they're happy. So if you are happy about the judgment that the, the witnesses don't have to come to Malawi, why were you using that to say you're not going to continue with the case? What's with the flip-flop? That's a charlatan. You see, you see what you're seeing there? That's a charlatan. That's a charlatan's face. That's how they do. Mm, they will say one thing. When they actually meant the art, and when the other happens, they say, No, that's what we were saying. Well, unless they were saying the opposite. Pastor Lange, this does not need to be a hater of Bashir. Mm -mm. It needs common sense. It needs common sense. These people have been fighting this thing for two years. They've been using this point to say, You see that part there? That's the part that kind of got me. How? They are happy about the decision. Serious <laughs> people. Hey, they are happy about uh, the decision. So now they are more than happy to go on with the case. They, you know, it's, it's, it's happy times. 
what were you doing all these last two years? They were dragging the subject so that they can seek favor from the Malawi government. The Malawi government did well from the beginning. Now I understand. <laughs> the Malawi government said, we do not want to even take part. Our system is capable of handling it. And he can't. You see now, he can't claim that he was not given a fair trial. He was given two years. Two years to be a fugitive. Two years. Why were they fighting using that point saying, no, the witnesses must come. And one of the guys who actually was talking about this entire subject said, why is it that the Bushiris are using, or their lawyers, are using the point of saying they need to be there physically in the court? Well, it's that you, don't, you only need that for a trial. This is not a trial. Come back. <laughs> Come back. Let them lock you there. <laughs> He saw, he saw, he was, he was inside the prison, he was like, hey, <laughs> you know, the, he heard the Christian song, he's not a Christian himself, mm -hmm. <laughs> you didn't see a future. <laughs> We shouldn't get out. <laughs> when he was inside, he's like, eh, <laughs> there's no way. A ninja is not coming out of here. He they pleaded for bail. Please bail, 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 bail. Came out. He made an exit. So now, for after two years, is it two years or three years? After two straight years of him claiming, this shows you something that I thought was very key to understanding. Bushiri's people will never understand. They will never understand truth. They will never understand why. Even if, even if you are not a hater, I'm going to repeat, even if you are not a hater of Bushir, these people spent two years fighting that the, the, uh, the witnesses must come to, to, to Malawi. All of a the sudden, they are happy. How? How are you happy? No, 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 no. Something is wrong here. Please, can common sense for those that are busy, just opposing for no reason, may you receive sense. How is it that, the, why would you fight something for two years only to say, yeah, no, by the way, we agree. That is the truth. You've been arguing for two years. That was your, that was your point of, you used that as your defense to say, uh, no, we are not continuing with this case until they are here physically. They were confident. Go watch the old videos. This is what I love about the internet. All these things are stored online. You can see them confident. They were sure. Which is not coming back. They were sure. Unless these witnesses are not here, this case is not going anywhere. They were sure. Yeah. The witnesses. Now the judge says, no, we don't need the witnesses. <laughs> it's done. We don't need the witnesses. This case must continue. South Africa must send the vid uh, videos of these people testifying. They are very much capable of doing that. Send it over and we continue. They say, <laughs> we are happy. Are you not ashamed of yourselves? <laughs> me, I would be ashamed. You know me, if it was me, I would be ashamed. Mm, th there would be a need for me to be ashamed. This, <laughs> this is shameful. But they say it out in the open. Yeah, we respect the law. No, but you've been fighting it for two years. Why were you fighting that same decision? Now you claim you are for it. Sometimes you don't need too much to see that a person is a child. Simple things just tell you that this one is a child. Straight up. Thank you for the show. You can share and comment your videos. For those people that are still lost without sense, may you receive sense. May you receive sense. Why is it that your people are now saying, you, the people you follow, they are now saying, no, they are happy. This decision is good. This decision. If this decision was good, why, why did you use it for all this while? For two years. It's sad that you still don't see through them. And I said before, they're just using anything to delay. She was trying to use, you know, I have, I'm building tourism in Malawi. The government said, no, we're not interrupting. We're not interfering. Let the court handle this matter properly. And you see what's happening. <laughs> Baba, there's a very high chance you are coming back.